Hello friends, welcome. If you enjoy fragrance, you found the right place. My name is Dave. I hope everybody's doing well, staying safe and healthy. If you can hear the birds in the background or some other noise, but I don't know what's more appealing than the gentle chirping of the birds out in the nature, out in the wild. That's the quintessential um, uh, vibe of the spring. So it's spring day and I was looking back at um, my my videos one of the first few re, uh, reviews that i did was for pardon from the house of nasamato i did a first impression and um it was ruined um, by it, both the audio it was so low so i know i had to record it again so this is the second video but after that review i did not even reach for it again the reason is because of uh, this bottle here Galan. Linston de Galan for home because I felt right away the similarity between these two just right away the first impression and um, because this bottle was uh, maybe half the price of this so because of that right away I, I thought oh my goodness and I couldn't get that out of my head so I think it ruined the, the review my first impression of it and since then I keep thinking you know I maybe I should give it a try uh, you know live with it longer see if there's any difference and since I'm gonna do the video again because of the bad audio so I think you know this might be a good time to do so I'm just gonna do a straight comparison between these two the Pardon from Nasamato and Linston de Galan at first I thought Pardon was copying Galan but it turned out this one came the Pardon came out 2011 Linston, some people call it Lich, came out 2015. So it was a reverse. <laughs> Galan was copying Pardon, which is kind of confusing because Galan is such a legendary house. Uh, it, it, the history is impeccable. Their scents are, are, are very famous and upper scale. So I would never imagine an independent house. Uh, you know, Galan copying a, a little house, comparably, okay, Galan is much bigger than um, NASA model. But with that said, so I'm just going to do a straight up comparison. I haven't even sprayed this since the, the first impression. So now I'm going to give it another chance. So whatever I'm going to get, I will share with you. Whew, I love this one. I love the Galan instant. Now the sprayer, the pardon is more pressurized. So I'm gonna just speak whatever I'm smelling. Oh, right away, Galan is fresher. Pardon is woodier. Straight blast, the wood, see notes is coming out. Lens stunt is lighter. The pardon, the chocolate is coming through. The sweeter tonka chocolate, woody. While Linston is under fresher take. And while pardon is staying woody with that darker scent. Okay, so huh, they're in diff they're going to different direction. Even though they're the same um, genre, but Oh, okay, okay. Now I see the difference. Um, hmm. Yeah, Lich is staying fresher. Uh, it's lighter. Okay. Yeah, it's, kill, it's still going. Oh, Galan is floral. More floral. While Lich is this woody chocolate punching through. Staying, staying tough, staying deep. While the Galan is this citrus coming out, there is there is like I want to say chocolate, but it's not. It's lighter than chocolate. Maybe it's cacao. And there's a licorice, uh, licorice scent that Pardon does not have, and it's, it's the citrus adding with the light patchouli, uh, star anise, bergamot, lemon. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah! Adding together with the cacao, 
is vibrant it's, li it's lifting this uh, lens that while Padon is staying very stubbornly uh, darker deeper it's not being lifted up oh okay I, I got you yeah see that the first impression is it's uh you know often it changes and that's a great thing about this this hobby you cannot just go by the first impression you gotta actually compare it so if i if i didn't do this um comparison side by side i would never have seen the difference yeah this is a lot fresher let's say um going from uh one being fresh 10 being dark linced linstant is at a three on the fresher side while pardon is staying at eight or nine on the darker side see that cool this is nice i'm glad i did this i'm enjoying the lens down the freshness the lemon the bergamot is, is coming and it's kind of like uh, swirling around the um the cacao the light chocolate cacao notes yeah it's staying oh this is nice i think there's like tea and jasmine and the light patchouli on here patchouli itself smells maybe uh, earthy or, or chocolate chocolatey okay so it's bringing that through while the napsomato is yeah it's sticking around maybe there's some magnolia and some floral but um the main thing is the, the wood it's probably agar wood but the chocolate it's um and the sandalwood the, especially the chocolate it's um yeah it's dark both are great both are really really good now that i see the difference i'm not that disappointed at pardon um look at this bottle it's a gorgeous bottle i i do enjoy the um the golan bottle as well they're classy but even though if you look at in the detail lb is more expensive so the bottle the wood cap and the um is a <laughs> everybody that saw this bottle they, they they're like turn their head and you know they'll take a second they'll look make us do a second take and look at this big giant head of a, a cap <laughs> they're always um taken aback by it and thought it's kind of funny you know i think it's funny too yeah i'm glad the, the girl on after almost five minutes is staying fresh yeah i enjoyed both of this and in different directions so i would say this garland is going to be, be suitable for um spring and light summer while pardon is going to be for the colder weather and this will punch through the pardon is is, is a heavy scent all right and i'm enjoying the chocolate you know how <laughs> i am kind of laughing at myself at how disappointed i was at first because the the um the uh, connection I had because of the similarity in my mind I was kind of uh, ticked off and upset but then now I know they're different my mind is allowing this this scent to come through and the appreciation to come through so you gotta do this this is a fun hobby so yeah they're in totally different direction now we're in the middle part of the fragrance and they're totally different they're like maybe 10% similar because it is sweet or cacao or chocolate and the wood is totally lighter it's going lighter this wood in here what's in notes but it's, it's light because of all those floral those those citrus that's helping it lifting it up while this one is staying dark with those uh, maybe some cinnamon but tonka sandalwood for sure all those deeper notes and the floral is very very dim in the way back in the background so it's not able to lift it up as much so this thing dark and and deep and and, and um, complex and sophisticated while this also is sophisticated but in a lighter lighter way oh i'm glad i did this i'm so happy i did this so okay uh with that said this is going to be for i think both are about the uh, category for uh, maybe the 25 and up okay for the ones that can appreciate fragrance more than just um, super sweet or marine or blue it's going to be for people that appreciate it but i think both could be could be for um, the masses it could be pretty versatile 
it's just nothing offensive about any of this you know maybe woodsy notes like this one the darker woods are not as uh, 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 common or or used in modern day perfumery but there's nothing offensive about this to me um, do people get offended by you know walking in the woods the smell or the nature no i don't think so right so that's what it is this pardon is is you know i can imagine drinking coffee walking in the in the wood with you know holding a starbucks coffee and just drinking it smelling that that coffee chocolate uh creamy okay it's not very creamy okay pardon it's not very creamy but i i just have a imagery of this smoothness with some cinnamon and floral coming through yeah it's pretty much staying this way and um yeah both have faded okay now after maybe 10 minutes both are on the lighter side now but it's great I i'm loving both okay i'm glad instead of having one scent i have two now they're different the initial blast after the first initial 30 seconds they just took two different direction so the easiest way to summarize is um this is a lighter take with citrus adding the sweetness of cacao while this stay dark you know, with the chocolate and the woods and uh, it just, it's just disturbingly staying um, pretty deep and dark okay and so with that so you could think of pardon as being more sophisticated while uh, Guerlain Nistan is more um, more vibrant okay com com comparing to pardon right great I did this so hopefully the audio come out okay so I don't have to do it a third time maybe I'll do it a third time as I wear pardon more okay Here's the bottle. It's a gorgeous bottle from the house of Nasamato. Um, the, the perfume around behind this one is Alessandro Gutierrez. It's a, it's a house from the, I think, the Netherlands. Okay. And, um, all right. Well, Golan is a famous old French house that everybody heard about. Ah, the time the chopper to take, take us away. So here's a box for Nasamato. All right, guys, it's always, um, I'm happy that you're here, glad that you're here, thank you, and um, see you next time.